Hi, everybody. Welcome to today's um, Pilates session for this week, the first one. So let's start with a roll down, shall we? So feet hip distance apart, inhale to lengthen, exhale to melt the chin, soften the knees and roll it down. Relax the body, swing the arms together and apart, together and apart. Inhale and exhale, stop the swinging and roll it up and lengthen up through the spine. Roll it, shoulders back and roll it forward. Very nice. Now lay onto your back. Lay up to the back, and we're going to do rocking of the pelvis. So feet hip distance, and we rock the pelvis backwards and forwards. Backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards. Just rocking the pelvis gently backwards and forwards. That's it. That's it. Off so you can see better. Now, if you have no weights, you're welcome to use the little weights, but you don't have to. So lift the arms up to the ceiling. We bring the one hand next to the hip, other hand over, and and five, four, press the feet down. Three, two, and one. Bring it up and bring the arms down to the floor. Now from here, inhale and exhale to imprint and roll it up. Send the kneecaps away. Inhale to hold and exhale to roll it back down one vertebra at a time. Inhale, exhale to imprint and roll it up. Send the kneecaps away. Inhale, hold and exhale to roll it through the spine down. Inhale and exhale to press up. Send that kneecaps away, pressing firmly into both feet as you roll through the spine down, releasing the tailbone. Inhale and exhale to roll it up. Sending the kneecaps away, squeezing the bum. All right, from there, You bring the feet as wide as the mat. That's it. And bring the arms out to the side and just drop the knees to the one side. Inhale and exhale to imprint and bring it back to center. And then drop the knees to the other side. Inhale and exhale to imprint and bring it back to center. From there, we're going to bring the legs together and we do the hundred. If you are up for a challenge, then you can lift the legs up to the ceiling and do split legs with me. Otherwise, you put the feet down, squeeze the knees. If you can do more than that, you can lift the knees to tabletop, just keep an imprinted spine. Otherwise, you're going to challenge yourself. Flex forward, drop the one leg, squeezing the bum of the leg that's dropping. Inhale for five and exhale for five. Inhale two, three, four, five, and exhale two, three, four, five. In two, three, four, five, and exhale two, three, four, five. 32, three, four, five, and exhale two. 42, three, four, five, and exhale two. 42, three, four, five, and exhale two, three. 62, three, four, five, and exhale two, three, four, five, 72. Five and exhale two, three, four, five. Exhale two, three, four. Ninety two, five and exhale two, three, four, five. Bring the legs together, bend the knees, put the head down, and put the feet down to the floor. Roll to the side and press yourself up, and then just bring the feet hip distance apart. Inhale, lengthen up, squeeze the bum, exhale to nod the chin. Spider crawl the fingers forward, reaching past the outside. Feet inhale and exhale to engage the abs, squeeze the bum, and lengthen up. 
Inhale and exhale to mark the chin, spider crawl, fingers forward to reach, inhale, hold. And exhale, squeeze the bum and lengthen up. Okay. Now bring the, bring the legs together and bring the hands onto the shoulders. Inhale and exhale to rotate. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now double rotation. Squeeze the bum cheeks and lengthen up through the spine. Last one. And bring it to the front and bring the arms down. Okay. Now we're going to roll down to the mat. That's it. Roll gently down and we're going to roll forward onto the beef. That's it. And we're going to do the back. So from here, bring the hands to the sides. We're going to press up onto four point kneeling. Lengthen your one leg for me and then lengthen the other leg for me. That's it. Bring the hands about underneath the shoulders. Shoulder blades start to get a lower rib into the body. Now bend the left knee and then you stretch the right leg away. That's it. And I'll circle that leg for me. Seven, eight, nine, and ten, and other direction two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And we switch the legs. So lengthen up and move. Little circles five, six, eight, nine, and ten, and other direction two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And bring the leg down, bring one leg down and the other leg down. Open up the knees and stretch it back. And then to roll up, bring it into four point kneeling and lower rib into the body. So slide the opposite hand and foot away from each other and slide opposite hand and foot away from each other. Last one, last set, and bring it back down. Now I'm just going to situate my body now. So as you can see what I do, we're going to slide the opposite hand and foot away from each other, lift and stretch, and then bring the hands and foot out, bring it back to center, and bring it down. Slide it away, out to the side, back, and glide back. Reach away. That's it. I'm on the edge of my mat, just shifting. That's good. <laughs> That's it, better. Always have a soft padding for the knees. That's it. Last one. That's it. And bring it back. Lean back. And just roll up. Okay, now lay onto your side for me. And if you have a little band, you can get the little band. Like this, or if you have a long band, you can just tie it together so that you've got like a circle kind of thing. So, you can bring the arm on the floor. 
And your hands in front, you're going to bend the top knee and you're going to bring the foot on top of the knee. Now, if you want to, you can have a little band around here, but it's not really necessary here. So, ribcage lifted, shoulder blades slide together, tight bottom leg, kneecaps facing forward. So, you're going to bring halfway down and lift it up. And five, four, three, two, one. Very good. Now from there, you're going to lift and lower, lift and lower. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Very nice. Now, so you're going to bend the bottom knee and straighten the top leg. That's it. You're going to lift and lower, move the leg to the front, and lift and lower it. So now lift this leg, bring it forward, tap it down, lift, bring it back. Tap down, lift, forward, tap down, lift, back, down. Forward, down, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, tap, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, tap, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, tap, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, tap, lift and back and bring the leg down now lift you're going to lift that leg and you're going to bring it back a little bit and pulse it for me two three four five six eight nine ten and bring it back down roll onto your back put the leg that worked on the other knee so ankle on the knee and inhale and exhale to flex forward, grab the hamstring and put the head down. So shoulder blades slide together down the back. Hips nice and square. And then you're slowly going to release that back down to the floor. Okay. Now I'll roll to the other side and then just do the other side. So arm flat onto the floor. You have the bottom leg straight, kneecap to the front, knee, foot on the knee. You're gonna bring the hand here in the front. So you bring the knee halfway down and lift, halfway down and lift. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And we lift up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and bring it down. And then we bend the bottom knee. That's it. Lift, bring it forward, tap it down, lift, and back, tap. Down, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, tap, lift, back, lift, forward, tap, lift, back, tap, lift, forward, tap, 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 lift, and bring it back. Now bring that foot back a little bit and then we pulse up and away. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And lower it down. Roll onto your back. The leg that work, that heel is going to be onto the knee. Inhale and exhale to flex forward. Grab the hamstring and pull it into the chest. 
Bring the head down, shoulder blades lie together down the back, hips nice and square, and we're going to breathe. And slowly to bring it back down to the floor. So if you're rolling to the side, and then you sit with the legs nice and wide, as wide as the mat. Bring the one foot on the inside of the thigh. Inhale to lift the hand of the bent knee, and then exhale. Glide over towards down the, uh, down the leg with the back of the hand on the inside of the thigh. Toes up, engage the edge, narrow that waistline. Anchoring the hip, engage the abs, squeeze the bum and lengthen up and bring it back down. Foot on the inside, pull the toe back, back of the hand on the inside of the thigh, out of the leg. Inhale to lift, stretch and exhale to flex it over. Engage the abs, squeeze the glutes, lengthen up, and then just bring it back down. All right, now sit forward onto your mat for seal. Lift one leg, hold around the ankle, other leg, hold around the ankle, soles the feet together, shoulder blades slide together down the back, clap, clap, clap. Inhale to roll back, clap, clap, clap. Exhale, clap, clap, clap. Three more, inhale and exhale, engaging the abs, squeezing the glutes. Last one, and exhale and bring the feet back down to the floor. Okay, now we're gonna do hip twist. So lay onto your um, elbows. So especially for men, um, elbows, for the women, you're welcome to do the lengthened arms. It's just if you have very short hammies. For those girls that also have the short hammies, you can also have the arms bent. And also for beginners. Okay, so bend the knees, squeeze the knees together, press it. Careful that you drop the ribs. I want you to make sure that you press it away from the mat. You can keep the knees bent and squeeze them and make a circle with the knees circle down and then circle it back up. Other direction, inhale and exhale. If you can do it with length of legs, you can. Keep the kneecaps facing you. Inhale and exhale. If you are doing it with long arms, this is how it looks like. Inhale and exhale. Tight abs. Arms are staying anchored, kneecaps facing you. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, squeezing the legs, exhale. If it's bent knees, inhale, draw that circle with the knees. Last two sets. Last one. Very good. Put the feet down. And now sit up the feet. Um, about hip distance apart, if you have a ball or something, a uh, cushion you want to squeeze between the knees, you're going to sit up nice and tall for me, sit up straight. If you can't sit up straight and you feel it's gripping into the hip flexors here, you can get a cushion to sit on. So I've got a cushion to sit on here. That's it. So feet hip distance apart. That's it. When the arms lengthen, you can have your weights in the hands. Pressing the feet down, 
lengthening up through the spine. Inhale to row back, sweep back, and exhale to sit up tall. Inhale to reach back and exhale. In and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Inhale to reach away and exhale. Inhale to reach, exhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. So you're pressing through the feet, engaging the abs and squeezing the glutes. And if you can squeeze into that knees, that ball in between the knees, then you do that. Last set. Last one. And bring the arms down. Just relax the body forward. That's it. And roll it back. Now, you can sit with the legs nice and wide for a sore. So, that's it. And inhale to rotate. Thumb down at the back, exhale, be down to the knee. Stretch on the outside of the ankle. Inhale to stack the spine, lift the thumb, bring it to the front. Inhale to rotate, thumb down at the back. Exhale, head down to the knee. Inhale to stack the spine, lift the thumb, and bring it to the front. Inhale, rotate, exhale. Inhale to stack the spine, bring it to the front. Inhale, thumb down, exhale, head down. Inhale, bring the thumb up and arms out to the side and arms down. Roll the shoulders. Okay. Now from there, breast stroke, and they onto your front, hands next to your shoulders. Okay. Shoulder blades slide together, squeeze the legs, exhale, dive into the water, and inhale to circle the arms back. And dive down, nose down, inhale to lift the chest, outline slightly forward. That's it. Two more. Last one. Bring the hands down and press back into a shell switch. And roll it up, lengthen up through the spine. Now lay onto your back. Bring the knees to tabletop, imprint the spine, and lengthen the legs. Bring one leg over the other, squeezing the thighs and the legs, pressing the arms down, and lifting. Inhale, hold, and bring it back down. Inhale, exhale to lift. Inhale to hold, and bring it back down. Exhale to lift, inhale, hold, bring it down. Last three. So it's that four breaths. Inhale, exhale to lift. Inhale, hold, and exhale down. Last one. Now well, switch over the knees, squeeze the thighs, the glutes, press into the arms. Inhale, connect. Exhale to lift. Inhale, hold, and exhale down. Inhale, exhale to lift. Inhale to hold, and exhale down. If you can lift up higher, then you can do that. Make sure that you're not using momentum, but that you're using your glutes and squeezing your legs. But if you are just, you can just do that, then that's also totally fine. And bring it down now. Keep on doing two more on each side um, if you can't do the next one. The next one is the more intermediate one. So bring the legs together, squeeze them. Inhale to lift above the hips and then exhale. Squeeze the glutes and connect the abs. Pressing the arms to roll over. Dip down, lift. Open the legs, engage the abs, squeeze the glutes. Press into the arms and bring it forward. Bring the legs together, inhale to lift. Exhale, engage the abs, squeeze up. Bring it over. Open the legs, dip it down, 
lift, close the legs, engage the abs, squeeze the bum, press into the arms, and roll down through. And then bend the knees and bringing it down to the, to the floor. Roll the uh, knees clockwise, and then anti-clockwise. That's it, and keep the feet down. Very good. All right, then from there, we're going to do abdominals. So interlace the fingers behind the head, squeeze the knees together for you. And then inhale to nod the chin, connect the lower abdominals, and exhale to flex forward. Inhale to hold, and exhale to bring it up. Inhale to nod the chin, connect, exhale flexing forward, inhale hold. And exhale down. Inhale to hold. And exhale down. Two more. Lift both knees to tabletop. Last two, last one, that's it, and then bring your feet down to the floor. Okay, from here we're doing teaser, one leg. So if you have a circle or something that you can squeeze, that's maybe as wide as your shoulders, you can squeeze that. It just helps with your engagement. Okay, so lift the knee to tabletop, press the foot on the floor down, bring the hands from above to over the shoulders, and exhale. Engage, lengthen the leg, knee in line with the other knee, inhale to lift, and exhale, press into the foot as you're rolling it down slowly. Remember, if the foot is too close to the body, it's going to be nearly impossible to come. So inhale to lift, engage the under armpit muscles, exhale to engage the rest, inhale to lift, and exhale, pressing into that foot and rolling it back down. Two more, sorry, inhale to lift, engage, and exhale. Inhale, lift, and exhale to bring it back down. Last one, inhale, engage under armpit muscles, exhale to flex forward. Inhale, lift, and exhale to press into the foot and roll it down. Switch over the legs. Inhale to lift and exhale. Inhale, lift, and exhale. Press into the foot, bringing it back down. Inhale, lift, engage the underarm muscles. Exhale to flex forward. Inhale to lift and exhale to bring it back down. Two more for me. Pressing out to that foot on the floor. Last one. That's it. Lift the knees to tabletop, squeeze the thighs. Inhale to lift and exhale. Inhale, lift and exhale. Inhale, lift. And exhale to bring it down. Two more. Inhale to lift, engage lower abdominals, squeeze the bum. Exhale, flex forward. Inhale, lift, squeeze legs. Exhale, engage the abdominals, squeeze the bum when you come down. Inhale, lift, last one. Exhale, squeeze the legs, squeeze into the arms. Inhale to lift. And exhale to bring it back down. Now, if you don't have any back issues, and you are fit enough to do it, you're gonna just do lengthen legs for me. Otherwise, you stick to the previous one. Inhale to lift, squeeze the thighs, engage the abs and lift. Inhale to lift and exhale to bring it down. Inhale and exhale to lift. Inhale and exhale to bring it down.
Last one, engage, switch, squeeze the legs, left, oops. And if it goes like that, then bend it <laughs> and bring it back down. No problem, we all are normal. Okay, so just bring one leg in on the inside or just towards the chest. And then the other side. And then both legs. And you just roll from side to side. And you're going to get up for me from here and do spinal rotation. So hands interlaced behind the head, hands are feet in line with the bum. Inhale to lift and exhale to rotate towards back. Engage the glutes and bring it back. Inhale to lift and exhale, rotate. And then just other side. Inhale and exhale. In from there. So we roll off the back of the sit bone, so you scoot over to one bum cheek. The arms is on the top part, but above the top knee, palms facing upwards, shoulder blades slide together down the back, bottom foot down, inhale to roll back and exhale to crunch up. So it's looking like this. On the other angle, rolling off the back of the sit bones, pressing into the foot. Very good. And then bring it back. Just rest for a second and then again roll back onto that bum cheek. Arms exactly the same. Roll off the back of the sit bones, lift the feet and lengthen. Two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and we bring it back to center. Okay. So now, just to give you an idea how it looks like on this side, we roll off the back of the sit bones and exhale to crunch up. Pressing the feet down. So you're rolling off the back of the sit bones up to crunch up. You're working the obliques. Three more. And then roll off the back of the sit bones, lift the feet and lengthen. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine and ten, and bring it back down. Lengthen up and exhale. Just relax the body. That's it, and then that's it for today, guys. Lengthen up through that spine and breathe in. And we're going to do a nice roll down. Inhale and exhale to lower the chin, soften the knees, roll it down, swing the arms together and apart. Stop and inhale and exhale to roll it up. Lift the shoulders and drop it. Slide the hands down the side. And you just swing the arms. Okay. Well, thank you very much for joining me today. I would see you again tomorrow.